Hi, and welcome to this brief tutorial for getting started with using TiddlyWiki on Firefox for Android. First, you'll need to install Firefox for Android from getfirefox.com and then visit tiddlywiki.com. When you get there, you'll see there's a Getting Started Tiddler that includes instructions for how to get up and running with TiddlyWiki. You need to scroll down to the link to Saving with TiddlyFox on Android. Click on that link and you'll open the special instructions for installing TiddlyFox on Android. First we have to install the TiddlyFox add-on. We visit the Mozilla add-on site, click Add to Firefox, choose to install it, and you'll see that you have to restart Firefox at this point. Then we can close that tab and go back to tiddlywiki.com, make our way again to those instructions for um, installing TiddlyWiki on Android, and install the second add-on. This one adds to Firefox for Android the ability to save links by clicking on them. And this time you'll see we don't need to restart the browser, we can just install it and then close that tab. Then we go back to tiddlywiki.com to save our empty document. So click and hold on the link to empty.html and choose Save Link. Then when we go to the notifications tray, we can see the downloaded file. When we try and open it, Android asks us where to open it, so we say Firefox. And then our file opens in Firefox, and we get a prompt from TiddlyFox asking if we want to enable it. So we say OK. Now we can create a new Tiddler. Let's type a title for the Tiddler. And then when we're done, we click the tick. And then we can click the save icon in TiddlyWiki. And now if we refresh the page and then go back to the recent tab, we can see there's the Tiddler that we saved. So there you go. There's the basic instructions for getting up and running with TiddlyWiki on Firefox for Android. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.